As usual, we're just going to randomly look at the hero icons here and see if any of them catches our eye. And I think I've found my answer. I haven't played this knife boy in a while now, right? So let's go ahead and do what we do best, and that is to auto-lock the hero that we want to play. And change our battle spell to execute because slot 5 looks like he wants to go jungler. I played Gushin in the XP lane and he's not so bad. Oh? Huh? What do you mean Rafaela? What do you mean dodge? That doesn't exist in this game. That's a different game you're talking about. Wait, what the frick is this? They the enemy team decided to abandon this match because they picked four mages and the game is letting them like do a remake or something? What about the time that I had to deal with four mages or four marksmen in my team in the past Monton? What about that? But really, that's a good feature. I'm proud of them for putting that in. And I am also happy that we seem to be able to lock in Knife Boy again. And hopefully we can take him to the jungle this time because I really don't want to be stuck on the side lane just fighting one enemy. And for our last teammate, we got a Catboy who also has Retribution. I'm watching you, Catboy. You better change that up or else you're gonna lose all your jewels. Oh, you did? Okay, that's great. That's that's a good Catboy. That's uh, very good. So, um, yeah, we got a pretty good lineup in about this skin. I'm not even sure why I decided to go for this one since I really don't play Gushin a lot, but um, it just looks really cool, I guess. And if we are going to murder monsters who are peacefully just um, hanging around in the jungle, we might as well look cool doing it, right? So that takes care of the blue buff, and what do we have here? My teammates being really, really good teammates, making the early game really easy for me. I mean, just look at this, free blue for the uh, Angela. I mean, I have blue, but I could have used the uh, golden XP from that enemy blue buff, right? See, a uh, really easy early game. Don't you agree with me, Ricky? Whose name also rhymes with lucky, which you are. Since I'm the jungler again for my team, that means you get to live a full life for the entirety of this game. So um, yeah, this is my life. My teammates are accomplishing uh, really exciting stuff on the side lanes and I'm here, stuck slicing this huge cockroach. Mr. Krabs, catch! Now we need to get to the other side of the map because that's where the turtle is and Ricky here is nice enough to let us uh, slide through his face. Come on guys, this is not the time to be messing around with the enemy team. We gotta cook this turtle real quick before their jungler gets here and it looks like he's here now so boo, get away from here. Nobody's allowed to watch while we cook this very tasty turtle soup. It's a secret recipe. It's uh, been passed through generations of knife boys. Hey, where are you guys going? Oh, this Angela and Franco still bullying the enemy jungler. Uh-oh, watch out Angela. That export looks like he's going to explode on your face. Don't worry, I will make sure that he spends a lifetime in jail along with that Tigreal. He's uh, an accomplice. Wait, what? We set no controller. What? What do you mean? Are Are you using some kind of controller to play Mobile Legends, like the one with the buttons and joystick? I gotta I gotta find out. I need an answer right now, Angela. And if you don't answer soon, I'm gonna have Ricky beat the answer out of you, like he's doing right now. Take it easy, though, Ricky. Take it Take it easy, man. We want answers. We don't want her dead. Oh, so that's that's what she means. The, uh, the like the on-screen controls. That's easy. It's called my. I mean joystick. Yeah, yeah. That's uh, that's what I meant. Meanwhile, in the bottom lane, we got an Irithil, more like Irided, and a Tigreal, more like Deadreal. Yeah, that's lame. At least uh, Angela knows uh, what a joystick now is. And we are back to our turtle soup cooking show where we all we do is smack this turtle like a hundred times until it's uh, nice and tender. And we finish it off by peppering it with some nice knives that I auto-targeted on the freaking Bulbasaur. 
And back to our regular programming of murdering monsters while watching and uh, being jealous of our teammates having all the fun. I can't take it anymore. I really need to blow these loads of knives on someone's face now. Oh, it's Tigreal. Okay, that's fine. That should um, keep me uh, sane for a while and go back to um, doing jungling because I'm a jungler. Hey, yo, does anybody um, need me? to do something like um, that jungle okay wait maybe we can make something happen here if we hide in this bush and bait this jumping cat lady but it seems like our hooker ran out of patience that's why he's running towards the enemies now and there's nothing we can do but of course support him in making sure we secure our kill but the securing of kills does not end there because this cyclops is going to survive. Haha, <laughs> I can go through not that wall. That was embarrassing. Shut up, Claude. You didn't see anything. You too, cyclops. Shut up. You only have one eye. Your peripheral vision might not be that good to see someone do something embarrassing like um, hitting his head on a wall. And here it goes. Turtle soup round three or four, I think. Don't tell me I'm not doing a good job as an objective secure. And suddenly I'm in the middle of a team fight. It's a good thing that Angela is riding on top of me because she can um, finish off that Tigreal because I ran out of skills. Why was I focusing Tigreal anyway? I guess we won't find the answer. It's another mystery unless I admit that it was because of the um, auto targeting. Dang, my teammates are really popping off. Look at the map right now. The, the enemies don't have any more towers aside from the um, inhibitor towers and they're dying in the mid lane while we have the Lord. Okay, I'm not sure if I should still do this Lord, but I'm just going to see what happens when I start this. The enemies might go here or they might try to kill one of our teammates. Okay, it's Angela that they're after and Harith. I know you're a big cat boy now, but that's a lot of enemies that you just angered. And now they are going after me. It's too bad that this ex-boy is going to regret it. Wow, having that near-death experience makes me feel more alive. But we really shouldn't be pushing our luck. So let's go back to base, or will we? Because we got a Claude who just destroyed our bottom lane, and I think our hooker man is herding him like a sheep, ready for slaughter. Oh crap, that's too dark. And um, why is this Angela riding on top of me after that kill? Uh, are you doing this to like celebrate? Alright, nobody from the enemy team even showed their face, so that lord was all ours. How are you feeling today, Ricky? Do you feel like there's a knife on your face? It's probably just your imagination. Alright, the lord is still like halfway in the top lane before it gets to the inhibitor tower. We still have uh, time to get this blue buff. And while they're busy with the Lord, we get this tower for free. And it looks like they're not distracted because the Lord is already dead. And now I'm in trouble. Oh crap. No. Well, no, 1-1. One, one. Stop it, please. You can't be kidding around like this. Don't do it. No way. Please stop. I mean, um, go for it. If you want to finish the game now, then, then finish it. I don't, uh, I don't even care anymore. That's why I'm going to use my ult to uh, get there really fast. And um, did, did one one just die? Wait, are they throwing the game? Oh no, that's that's not what I want either. Holy sheets of paper! Even our cat boy, who's already uh, well fed or fully fed, is dying now. We gotta, we gotta take care, of Franco. I guess we just gotta back off. We should just uh, clear the waves and don't do anything risky. I mean, yep, the enemies are trying to take the blue buff, but we're not going to attack them. Instead, we are going to murder them as quickly as all crap. Why do I keep thinking with my foot in crucial situations? But that is fine. Our teammates did a good job in distracting the enemies and actually killing them. But someone is definitely doing the Lord here, right? I surely saw something. Yeah, there he is, and I am too late. But wait, their base is already getting attacked by the minions. I don't think Claude will get there in time, but neither will I. All I gotta do though is jump over this and oh. It was um it was too late. But we tried our best boys. We tried our best to um get a victory selfie that we couldn't get. 
It's uh, really such a shame. I even wore a special um, skin for the special occasion. But that's just how victory selfies are, my friends. If you can get them all the time, then they wouldn't be special, right? So yeah, that is my gameplay of Knife Boy Gushin. I hope you enjoyed it, even though I know that Gushin mains are crying their eyes right now with blood. But that is fine, because nobody cares, and we're all just here to have fun and have a good time. So again, my name is Shinman Takizo, reminding you to always stay safe, stay healthy, and always take care of yourself. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hit like if you enjoyed this one. Check out our previous uploads for the many and different heroes we played in the past. Subscribe for more of these in the future. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.